Wow, what a beautiful sunny day. You know what, I did plan to go inside the cottage and start something in there today, but I think I'm gonna sit up outside. I've got another job I don't need to do. It's a job that I like to do. Let's get creative. So what I plan to do is turn these plain and simple teak blanks into something, well, something that you'd want to buy. So let's see whether I can work my magic on these. Pencil. Bigger ears. Now sometimes I just pick up an object that I've got, look at it, I like the shape, maybe I'll take inspiration from this piece. Have a little doodle, make sure that the lines flow, work for the design. Sometimes it doesn't work. I have to alter it, but it's all part of the creative process. Everyone is unique. Always stamp them with something at the end now. Um, Jasmine bought me a beautiful little branding iron, so that'll be stamped up as well. These will be available in my website shop, welcome to Sean'sWorld.com, link in the description. Everything I raise through sales on there goes back into the project, helps me buy materials and keeps the, uh, keeps the project marching on. Okay, let's have a little play about with these designs and uh, I'll show you what I'll come up with. really surprised me I didn't expect this I was expecting a parcel from someone else but Tom has designed this fantastic mug ain't that design great cheers Tom hmm don't know what to say now apart from well done mate that is brilliant now what he's done is took inspiration from the front of the cottages done the design all himself got it all printed up well I'm going to try it out let you know what I think of it. Cheers everyone. Cup of tea time. Oh, Well, that's that tried and tested. Now, if you'd like to purchase one of these, I'm selling them exclusively through my website shop, welcome to Sean'sWorld.com. Now, they're available now, so don't forget, after this video, head on over there and get yourself one. If you like an exclusive Sean's World cup, we will be releasing t-shirts and caps shortly. Um, so yeah, they'll be available in the website shop as well. Great design. Tom's made, what do you think? I think it's fabulous. This is nice and shady in here now. And the willows started to spray up. Mind you, we've had some rain. Not all of them, but not checked, but I think the majority of them have, which is encouraging. I could sit here all day, it's beautiful in here.
Storm's World. Handcrafted in Normandy. The natural beauty of the teak certainly comes through. I'm using food grade mineral oil, so perfectly safe to put food. So we can use it as a charcuterie board or a chopping board. Don't forget there's only a limited amount of these special one-offs. Nothing quite as beautiful as nature. Look at that. If you do purchase one of these, they will need the occasional treatment of mineral oil. Okay, that'll have several coats of that. Let it soak in each time, and that's now available on my website shop. Before and after. Well, what do you think? I'm pretty pleased with the transformation. Now as we speak, I've got these two available. Like I say, by the time the video goes out, nine times out of ten. They've already gone, but I will continue to make a few of them. Not that many. They do take me quite, you know, quite a few hours, to be honest with you. So, time is sometimes at a premium for me, but I do like to, to make a few here and there. It keeps the old creativity going, and it gives me a break from working in the cottage. And it's also been very, very nice to work out in the sun. Even when I'm working on the cottage in the roof, you know, I was out in the sun, which is nice. You need a little bit of that on you to warm your bones. It was very handy installing this window because it allowed me access out onto the roof to see actually where the, the leak was coming in from down, you know, it's running down the, down the chimney. So I think I've located it now. So that's been a real big help actually. You know, while I think about it, I think I'll get my scaffold set up here. Yeah, it was just too close to the house, so when I got the next lift on, it would have hit the tile, so I've had to bring it out. Build it up with some timbers, but that's fine. And it's still perfectly safe, we're going to screw it all together. And then I can come up and have a few lifts. So the next job will be to get some ratchet straps on there, tie it off so it's nice and secure so I can get the ladders round and get up on the roof and have a closer look at that problem. Great design eh? Let us know what you think. Now every single sale does help to fund this project so it'd be much appreciated you know if you could check them out. Welcome to Seansworld.com. Treat yourself to a mug and a cup of tea or coffee. Just walk for me at the minute. Right, we're on to the next stage now. We're uh, gradually approaching the roof. Well, that's it for this video. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye for now.